Hi, I'm Charles Lewis and welcome to my photography studio. You know, I'm a photographer just like you and I've had a lot of years of experience at earning a really good living at photography. And one of the things that I have discovered over the years is that a huge mistake that most photographers make because we're not professionally trained salespeople. You know, we're photographers for heaven's sakes. We're good with f-stop, shutter speeds, digital, Photoshop. You know, that's what we love. That's what we're good at. But we're not professionally trained salespeople, and that really can hurt us if we're not careful. One of the most powerful discoveries that I have made in my years of studying and researching sales techniques for the photog my photography business is trial closes. A trial close is a question, the answer to which indicates where the prospect is in the buying process. It, it invites feedback. Now, if you're yawning and you're saying, oh, this is so boring, what does this have to do with photography? This has everything to do with photography because you're the photographer and you want to earn a living doing this. A trial close, let me give you an example. My favorite trial close is how do you feel about that? If you're talking with someone, whether it's on the telephone, whether it's on the internet, whether it's in person, and, and you say a statement, let's say you say the grass is green, Okay, it's a statement. You end it with, how do you feel about that? And what that does is it invites that other person to give you feedback back. It says, well, I don't, I don't agree with you that grass is always green. Sometimes grass is brown. If it's really dead, it's... See, you're, you're, if you want people to invest in your photography, you are not a photographer. You are a marketer and seller of photographic services. You just have chosen photography to be the business you're in, but you're a marketer and a seller. So you've got to become as good at your sales techniques and as good at your marketing techniques as you are with your camera techniques and your photography and your Photoshop stuff. So if you're talking and you want to get someone to hire you, you want to get someone to give you money for doing what you love to do, you've got to use trial closes throughout the whole conversation. So whenever you say anything, just say, how do you feel about that? How does that sound? Isn't this exciting? Sounds kind of neat, doesn't it? Those are all trial closes. And then you shut up and you listen to what she says back. And then based on what she says back, you move forward. Instead of just talk, 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 we're really good, we got a special going on, we've won awards, you got to get in here. That does not work in this day and age. So to build a relationship, to build rapport with your prospects, if you get good at the stuff we're talking about right now, you will earn a tremendous living doing what you love to do, photography. Now, if you enjoyed this hot tip, I urge you to go to www.cjlewis.com slash freesecrets.html and you'll see a whole bunch of other stuff where that'll help you earn a good living doing what you love to do. I'll talk to you next time.